Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name is Georgia and this is Georgia's Fragrance World. If you're first time, you're welcome. Make sure to subscribe and join the family. If you repeat, thank you so much for watching me. I really do appreciate. Let me go straight into today's fragrance. Today I'm going to talk about my very first ever fragrance from the house of Jean-Paul Gaultier. I know, I'm so excited. So I've actually um, admired this house from a distance, especially when the scandal series came out like i've seen a lot of reviews about the scandals um on the male side you have the ultra male the limau you know so this is like a house i actually respect a lot but i've never really owned a fragrance from them until super 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 duper excited when i saw this fragrance i knew i just had to get my hands on it unfortunately it sold even though <laughs> yeah it's sold so yeah but i'm definitely 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 gonna find a replacement real soon so let's get straight to the fragrance so i absolutely love the packaging this is gorgeous you have the it's quite shiny so i don't know if you'd see but i have the shampoo gaultier written on it and then you have classic written on it very chic very simple but i think this is like um Jean-Paul Gaultier's um, signature packaging. They have this whole tin thing going on. I think it's pretty cool if you ask me. It's different. So we like different, right? We like to have variety in our collection. So different is good. Let's see how the bottle looks like. <laughs> it's a bit difficult. Pause. Let me open it. I'll get back. Okay, so we have a winner here. Now look at her i know i know it's so gorgeous like it's so oh i'm actually showing you the back yeah this is the beauty i am talking about now look at her we like different don't we and i love the fact that it doesn't come like with a cup like the regular ones mm. let's get into the juice you're in for a ride <laughs> okay this girl right here the sleek chic girl right here is a bomb it's a gourmand it's classy it's beautiful it's long lasting it's what else do you want from your fragrance it projects like crazy it gives you a beautiful trail like i used this once i've used it once actually i went to the office and then one of my colleagues actually told me that he could smell me after I had left. You know, he came in after I left. And then he came to tell me he could smell. Yo, yo, yo. This girl right here is like the bomb. This is actually what I expect from, you know, um, a vanilla goma. Not full on vanilla, but vanilla goma, you know, sweet fragrance. Like, yo, this is good. It's, it's strong, but it's not overbearing. Wait. I think I'm, I'm speeding myself up. Let's check out the notes first and then we'll get into the juice again. You will find the notes on the left, the accord on the right. Okay, so the classic Essence de Parfum by Jean-Paul Gaultier, it's not, um, it's not a cloyingly sweet fragrance, although it is really sweet. It's vanilla sweet, yes. It's, um, it's a bit floral. It's, um, Hmm. it's not musky at all it's a bit powdery though so um i think the ginger and then the citrus nuances it has or notes that it has you know prevents it from getting cloying or you know going to gourmand like full-on gourmand you understand so even though like it's sweet delicious it still has like a hint of you know freshness and then you know subdued subtleness to it but hey, this fragrance is in no way subtle as a total. It's a full fragrance. Like, it's it's full. Like, it's full-bodied, you know? When you smell it... Okay, so I sprayed this on my arm like two hours ago. Oh, it's still there. It's very powdery now. The vanilla... I think this is the perfect evening out scent. I think you're going to, like, be grabbing a whole lot of attention. Even when you go for, like, an event where, you know, everybody's wearing their own perfumes... You're going to grab some great, you know, some really good attention with this one. People are going to notice what you're wearing. People are going to smell you despite what everyone else is wearing. It's, it's, it's really, really, really sweet. 
And then, you know, at the end of the day, when, like, it really settles, it becomes this delicate, beautiful skin scent. Like, after, you know, it's, you know, after how, how many of hours it's going to last on you. Now, it's still, you know, really good on there. So, it hasn't become, like, a total skin scent yet. But it, formed, it becomes, like, a really beautiful one. I think from the beginning to the end of this fragrance, it develops. It's quite complex. Even though the notes are not so many. The fragrance develops at every stage. It's quite complex. It's not very simple. And I love it. I do. I really, really do like this. I think it's going to be um, also great for like an event, you know, where you really want to feel chic, where you're all dressed up. It's going to go like really great with like a really great dress. It's going to go well with a very great dress, you know, dressed up, full makeup on, you know, feeling all chic and all bougie and all that, you know, like it's a really, really, really good scent to go with. I think you can you can you can take it for you know in Ghana we love weddings and all that you can wear for weddings. I think you should wear for her like happy occasions, you know, like out there occasions like events, you know, corporate dinners, you know, date nights, you know, dressed up events and all that. I don't think it's a fragrance you should be wearing like up and about to be a waste of goodness. So yeah, I think that's about where you can wear it. But in aside that, hey, wherever you want to wear your fragrance to, please do. And enjoy the hell out of your fragrance. I didn't say that. On that beast mode projection and sillage and everything, you should, you know, you can do probably anything about three, four sprays should do. One, two sprays is really good, but it's not going to give you that, like, you know, hey, I'm here kind of thing that you're looking for. So if you really want to make a statement, anything above three, four sprays should do. Depending on your environment, if you're in a really like open place, I think about four plot sprays would do with that, you know, giving you the whole baseboard thing going on. I do like five, six. I even do eight sometimes. Yeah, I'm like a perfume freak like that. I'm, um, MJ wants to like, we perfume crazy people here. Yeah. <laughs> so some of us are like crazy perfume people. So we do crazy things with perfumes, but hey, do whatever makes you happy. Okay, it's just a perfectly balanced fragrance. It's, it's just a beautiful fragrance. I don't think you can go wrong with this one. It has the, you know, semblances of the La Vie Bells and, you know, those really popular, sweet, long-lasting fragrances. But the difference between this one and those ones is that those could get, you know, cloying with a sweetness. But this is just like, I think it's like their madame. <laughs> I can call this one their madame. Because this is everything. It's it's a very good fragrance. I think it would be perfect as a signature scent. You can actually use it as a signature scent, you know. Um, because it's not cloying, it would be okay even if the weather is warm. But probably it might perform like best if the weather is, you know, in between. Not too cold, not too warm. Like four-ish, you know. Yeah. And also, um, for almost all events, like I said, that's for fragrance. Some people say some fragrance is not appropriate for work. I'm going to wear it to work and I'm going to love it. They might say it's not appropriate for this. I'm going to wear it. I'm going to love it. So what if I feel like wearing just wear? And this girl, mm, you can wear whatever anytime you want. Because I think it's, it's, it's that versatile. Like it's, it's really versatile. I don't know what more I can actually say about this fragrance. Because look, if you're somebody who is into like really sweet fragrances, you know, sweet but with a kick, you know, sweet but with class, sweet but mature, sweet but, you know, sophisticated. This is perfect. If you're somebody who is um, who is looking for that fragrance that will actually last you throughout like a really long time, I think you can get like a good 8 to 12 hours on this, depending on how many sprays and where you spray, you know. I told you sometimes I actually put the sprays on my clothes to make them last longer. Some people put it in their hair. So if you do that, I'm sure you should get like a good 12 plus hours on this. The projection is good. It has a great sillage. Everybody around you can smell you. It forms a nice trail. Even after you are gone, people can still smell you. I have experienced it firsthand. So this fragrance is like, mm, it's there. I, I don't know any, I don't know anyone who, who can actually get something bad to say about this fragrance. Even people who don't like sweet scents. Because like I said, even though it's sweet, it's not cloying. It's very mature. It's very sophisticated. So all in all, I think this um, perfume is a great one. The name is Classic Essence de Parfum. So it's Jean-Paul Gaultier Classic. And this is the Essence de Parfum. I love, 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 love this fragrance. I'm not really a huge fan of the La Vie Bells and those other fragrances. 
like I have hinted, I do like them. They are great. But like I always say, I have some reservations. I'll be reviewing it, but then with time, I want to take my time, prepare my arguments, let nobody come and box me because I know how people are crazy about like And trust me, I think it's like the bestseller. Probably, you know, ranking with the Chanel, Coco Mademoiselles, and those was like, or even better. It's, it sells great. Like, people love it. You can smell it. It's great signature, but mm, I think I'll choose Shampoo Goatee here anytime, anywhere. I absolutely love this fragrance. It's a great one. So, yeah, I think that's about it. If you've used it before, let me know your comments or your thoughts in the comment section. If you have any other recommendations or fragrances that you think have similar nuances that you think I'm going to like, let me know in the comment section. If you have any fragrances you want me to review, let me know in the comment section. Like I say, make sure you subscribe. Please, 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 please subscribe. It really helps my page a lot. And like if you do like the content and make sure to come back again. See you in the next review. I love you all so much and thanks for watching. Mwah.